Hey, today I'd like to show you Maxpedition's Merlin Folding Backpack. You can see this pack at maxpedition.com. I don't hear a whole lot of buzz online about this, this um, backpack, but it sure is interesting. A few of you wonder who I am or what I do. <laughs> well, one of the things I do is whoosh, I come out in the woods and I set out my digital trail cam. This is one of my favorite places. This is a, a hollowed out log and it just sits here right perfect about three feet from the ground. The flash and the viewfinder are still visible. There's a path right behind where the camera is. I caught some deer there the other day, but we do see black bear in our area. But where this camera is right now seems to be um, a traverse for them. So I hope to get some pictures this season. Maybe I'll insert a couple of photos that I've gotten in the past with this digital trail cam. really cool. It's a lot of fun. It's something I like to do. I like to hike. I like to set my camera out. I hike out the next morning and pick it up. It's fun. It's cool. So anyway, let's get back to the Maxpedition Merlin folding backpack. And what it is, basically, it's a Molly attachment. It's got the pals back here that you can attach it to your backpack. I think it's primarily you would attach it if you had one of those big framed or larger backpacks. So you go out on a three or four day hike and then you can remove this and use this as your day bag to go for your quick jaunts from your campsite. So wait till you see it when it opens, it's pretty amazing. So what it is is it has, you know, this sleeve here which can hold my tripod for my camera by the way. It's got these shock cord things in the front, velcro. On the back you saw it has pals. It has this interesting little snap which I'll talk about in one second. So what it has is two zipper compartments. Front. The front has three elastic loops inside of it to hold your stuff. That can hold your um, cell phone. When it opens up, it actually has more space. Right now, the, the actual backpack is kind of infiltrating on this space, but it's still a good size to carry your stuff. So then it also has, in the rear, another zipper. It's also a nice big space. It has a little bit of a sleeve in there to contain a little notebook or something so it doesn't fall out. What's interesting about the back zipper is it zippers halfway here and on this side there's a little snap stop to make sure you don't zipper it too far so your stuff falls out. And you'll see why later the rear zipper opens like three, four fifths. So let's unzipper the backpack. So here it is. Here is the Merlin folding backpack. It's got these two straps down at the bottom. It's got a loop, a loop on the top to hold it. And there's your two pouches. Pouch one here, pouch two here. So now you open pouch two and get in there. Look how big it is. It's really, really spacious. Easily get both of them, no problem. These two pouches are seven by five by two. Seven by five by two. They're really spacious. They can really hold a lot of stuff. The inside of the Merlin folding backpack is just enormous. I mean, it's enormous. I, I'm gonna have to go home and insert some footage of how much stuff I could fit in here. I, I could probably fit a whole sleeping bag. How many blankets? How many towels? It, it, out here in the woods, I can't even, I can't even show you how big. Huge. Here it is. Now I must say the straps are more simply built than a lot of the stuff Maxpedition makes. We have to remember this is a folding backpack. It, it is lightweight. I think it's 18 ounces um, total weight. So some of the materials are 
thinner to to accommodate that as a molly to attach to your pack. The bottom is like a one inch strap on here. So I'm gonna not recommend this kind of a bag for books or laptops and things like that. Things with like significant weight. It's built more as just a quick day pack more than a really sturdy, heavy duty, long day, multi-day carry bag. So the inside has no sleeves or any pockets or anything. It's just one open compartment here. We've got the two pouches here. There's no molly or pal attachments on the side for water bottles or anything. But I think this is what the water bottle solution is that Max Maxwell came up with. Behind the straps here, you'll see the little tab, you pull it open, a little bit of Velcro, and it goes all the way down, the entire length of the bag. And I think that's for a uh, water bladder. You can stick your 100-ounce water, water bladder in there, have the tube run out, close it up here. Now you got your water source right with you. You can carry just a ton of stuff in there. I mean, it's really amazing how much you can carry. And there's pals in the front pouch here. You can attach something here, maybe an M1 waste pack or a Janus or something like that. Let's fold it up, see how it folds so easy. Fold it in. So some of the uses I was thinking that you can use the Merlin folding backpack for are when you go on vacation, you can stick this thing in your luggage, like if you're going on a cruise, you can stick it in your luggage and use it on those day trips that they have into the islands and stuff. This is your backpack. I mean, it holds so much stuff, it's unbelievable. And another idea I came up with, and the more I think about it, the more I think it's brilliant, is this would be a really nice beach bag. I mean, seriously. The material, let me open it real quick again. This material is lightweight nylon. It's not the heavy duty million denier, whatever they call this Maxpedition product stuff. It's uh, it's heavy nylon. It's nice and durable, yet it's still, it'll wipe, it wipe dry. It will hang dry really easily. I think you can fit all your towels, your beach towels in there, your beach blanket, your lunch, because you know you're gonna have to wear this as a backpack across the beach while you carry the cooler and the whole family's chairs, you know what I'm saying? This is OD Green. I don't really have a lot of stuff in OD Green, but I think this is really nice. It's kind of bright in a way. You know, it's all folded up in your suitcase. When you get to your beach house, you open it up. This is now your beach bag, or the bag you pack up to take out on the boat. It's cool. So there it is, nice and compact. 18 ounces, 8 inches by 5 inches by 4 inches, attach it to your pack, use it as an extra bag when you get to your destination. This is just a really interesting bag, you can check it out at maxpedition.com, and we'll see you again. Thanks again guys.